it's a huge step. First Presbyterian Church continues to rebuild and a construction project is about to be completed. We'll have this roof on and we'll have our building uh, dried in. The roof will protect the inside of the building from any further weather damage, allowing plans for the rest of the building to move forward. We'll have a very, very well built roof and then we can take our time, the time necessary to do the interior work. Contractors and architects met with Brown today and looked inside the church. While rebuilding hasn't always been easy, it's a very long and involved process. One of the hardest parts is now behind them. Our contractor tells us that the roof is the most complex part of the rebuild. First Presbyterian has been in the building for nearly 70 years. On one level, it's discouraging to see something that you love damaged or destroyed, but on a, at its base level, basic level, the church is the people. The church currently meets in a different space, but members say they look forward to being back in downtown Panama City. There are certain things we can do with a rented space, uh, but there are a number of things we can't do. And so we look forward to the day when we've got our own building 24-7. Uh, we can do any ministry that God lays on our hearts to do. Brown says it will be several months before they're back inside. News 13 will continue to follow the church's progress. In Panama City, Michelle Kaufman, News 13, Panhandle Strong.